all set up for a final stage where anything could happen. The final day of the Abu Dhabi tour had a sting in the tail at the end of 199 kilometers on stage 5. We saw a 9 rider break get away early on a showery morning in Abu Dhabi which included Gazprom Rosvelo's Nikolai Trusov in the black jersey as leader of the intermediate sprints competition. He had to wait until the 143rd kilometer to finally secure enough points to guarantee his win in that classification. The break had been enjoying a lead of nearly 10 minutes for most of the day, but the deficit to the peloton was rapidly decreasing as we headed towards the final climb. Ajay Désert La Mondiale's Rudy Barbier won the second intermediate sprint at kilometer 185, just a short stretch away from the foot of Jabel Hafit. The race started to break up as soon as the road tilted upwards, with Astana pushing the pace to try and set up their main GC threat, Miguel Angel Lopez. Back up front, all that was left of that original nine-man break was the unlikely duo of Andre Greipel and Lawson Craddock. They wouldn't stay away for long, attacks were flying back in the main group instigated by Alejandro Valverde just 24 seconds down on GC at the start of the day. This was a dangerous move for race leader Rowan Dennis, but he was starting to find the pace a little too hot to handle. Tom Dumoulin also began to fade, but Sunweb still had Wilco Kelderman up at the head of the race, which now featured a selection of seven riders. While Lopez made his move, Dumoulin was having a terrible time further down the mountain with yet more mechanical issues. Valverde got across to the young Colombian and the pair stayed away until the finish. Valverde managed to get ahead on the final left-hand corner and held it until the line, taking the stage and 10 crucial bonus seconds. Julian Alaphilippe led Rafael Maika and Wilco Kelderman home 15 seconds later, which meant that Valverde had indeed done enough to clinch the leader's red jersey. Here are your stage standings and a shout out to young Nicholas Egg of Trek Segafredo, holding his own with some of the best climbers in the world to finish 7th on the day. Rowan Dennis crossed the line a minute and 43 after Valverde in 23rd. As we look at the final general classification, we wonder if Alejandro Valverde will ever slow down. 37 years of age but still looking in incredible shape and building form for the Ardennes Classics and the Tour de France later in the year. Kelderman takes an understated second place. Superman Lopez may not have won the stage, but he can console himself with a third step on the podium, plus the white jersey as best young rider. Elio Viviani proved to be the most consistent sprinter at the race. He wins the green jersey of the points competition. Nikolai Trusov is the king of the breakaway, taking the black intermediate sprints jersey. And Bora Hansgrohe win best team after a strong collective performance on the final climb today that saw them place three riders inside the top 15. Thank you for watching our coverage of the Abu Dhabi Tour. If you want to catch up on what happened yesterday in the individual time trial, there's a link on screen for you now.